let's get the hot comb. When you fell from heaven, did you fall with grace? Hey y'all, welcome back to my channel. So my wig came in, I'm so excited. It's from Original Hairport on Instagram. Um I'm so excited. I've been tracking it all week. So I'm gonna look like a crackhead because I just want my wig on. So this is the package. Super cute. It's like virgin hair, I think. Um no, unprocessed or raw hair. Raw I think it is. I'll find her Instagram and put it on there, but customer service is A1. She's really good. Oh, so excited. Let's see. She told me she took it out of the um out of the little net because she said it'll get frizzy. But <sighs> Alright, it's a closure straight. And oh my god, I'm putting this on right now. It's a four by four, which is fine with me. 26 inches. And I think I got it when she had her Black Friday sale. So it was like 250 and then you know, tax and shipping was like 260. But it's raw hair, so you know. Look at that. Oof, 26 inches. Alright. Let's get started. And I don't even have it in um, closure braids. Which I think so far, because I can't see. Let's get the hot comb. Okay, so I'm just gonna go section by section. Um, for the closure, really. That's it, but you'll see it throughout the video. Now you see the difference in it being hot combed and it being in its natural state. Now I also began to pluck that last part of the part because that part, um, the part was a little too short for me. So I decided to go in with the comb and um, make it a little bit longer and you'll see where I start to pluck it. Just kind of go straight, follow that line and you just pluck straight down the middle so you have a really straight um, narrow line Alright y'all so let's install it now So Wig cap I don't care which color it is. I just don't use black ones unless the um Cap is balding Yeah, you know so I got one from I think I, this probably came from when I buy here Okay, I don't feel like bleaching any knots and washing no hair, so I'm going to use the Black Radiant called Soft Focus. It's all oh, y'all, it's all. Oh. Um, color, oh, 9202 Creamy Bronze Finish, that's what it is. 9202 Pelasco on there too. We're going to use that as our um, bleaching replacement. So let me get a brush. Alright, y'all. So the only thing we did was hot comb the part. 
That's it, that's all. Nothing else. Heart and that front and that top piece is what you need to really focus on. Okay. So here we are. And this is what it looks like here. Let's adjust the straps because there's straps and there's also an elastic band in it. I have a small head, so I'm gonna do the last song. The openings on the end because, um, yeah, I have a small head, but you can always just adjust and kind of do what works best for you really and sometimes wigs are too still too big for my head and i have to like tie them See, this happens do you know what i forgot to do Here's the problem. So already it looks like we punched our knots and we didn't do nothing yet. So I don't know how to do the spray and, and the whole hoopla of things. So what I do is try to cut the lace off real raggedy. Like. There's no, um, Like I don't have a consistent way of doing this or whatever you call it. No motive. Just trying to get it off so the like don't make it too neat. The neater it is, then the more unnatural it looks. Alright. And then I may go back and just cut off some lace like the parts that look weird like they don't belong so this is what it looks like okay. what is that all right i like to put it yep above the forehead a little bit so it can lay down better And this is the even spray hair store. Okay. 
These things done came loose already. Ghetto. It's giving ghetto. I don't want to do this anymore. So here's where I show you guys how to blend your natural scalp and the stocking cap without having to do the ball cap method. Please like, comment, and subscribe. Bye.